ladies and gentlemen, my name is Reese Cake and welcome back to Lightfall. Last time we, um, I believe we entered the uh, marshland and we uh, somehow got down here. Is there anything over here? There is indeed. Hooray for curiosity. Oh, that got very silent all of a sudden. Did it not? I am not sure at all I can get up there. I cannot. Like, how would you do that? Unless... No, it doesn't give, like, height. It just gives length, kind of. That makes sense. So I assume I cannot get that yet. That sucks. Hey! That's, um... Olas, or whatever his name was, right? Okay. No. Okay, what is going on with this then? Oh, eh? Oh! So it's basically teaching me- Whoa, hello! So it's teaching me to, um... But isn't that kind of what I have been doing? I don't know. It, it kind of seems like I have been doing this for quite a while. I might- Oh my. I might have been doing that. Oh, I see, I see. I see, I see. I see, I see what it's trying to tell me or show me. Oh my god, that is cool, Took actually. You long enough. While you were taking a nap in there, I heard a huge explosion ahead. We should be careful. First of all, I was not taking a nap. I was walked into a different reality to test some skills. Second of all, we can't all have fucking wings, dude. Give me some slag, would ya? Jesus Christ, and a bicycle. I want to go out there! Oh, actually, hey, 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 hey. Now, let's see if we can do this. Damn it. <gasps> ah. This might not be the case. I might not be able to do this, but I'm going to try. Because it might actually give me a little height. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, let's take this with us just in case, first of all. Okay, this uh, AP stuff is actually very, very smart. I can appreciate that. What is over here? Ah, I see you've met the witch. She's That's a, a bit witch? Odd, but she takes good care of her children. Oh, that is cool! Oh, hello! Can I can I speak to you? No? Oh, that is cool though! I met the witch! That's cool! <laughs> that is nice! Wow! Okay, so there was something over here. That's nice! I was like, oh god, am I gonna see a blind end or a dead end? Okay, November 21st. It's not long after the last one. When my condition looked so very grim, the tide finally turned. I was half awake, fighting with every inch of my body to keep walking, when suddenly two huge shadows swooped from above and landed in front of us. Two owls, bigger than men, stood right there, carefully examining us. Ruckus uh, couldn't even unseat uh, his weapon in time before he was sent flying effortlessly by one of them. Uh oh. Although we um, outnumbered them eight to two, there was no doubt in my mind that we were no match for them. Especially with the disease spreading amongst us. The older owl suddenly questions us. I bet you this is Strix one of them. What are you doing on these lands? We have never seen your kind before. I weakly answered that we were friends with the great animus and that- Ah! The one from uh, the previous land and that we were coming in peace. We know no one of this name. I will ask one more time. What is your purpose here? The owl impatiently replied. I am sure it's Strix. Not in doubt. 
I, I would be thrilled to continue this discussion further. There are so many things I'd like to ask you, but the truth is my head will explode any seconds now. And, and then, ah yes, you have been in contact with the Eratus Avis toxin. The owl, cal the, the owl calmly re explained. The Eratus what? So you are aware of the virus? I nervously replied. Okay, so yeah. Of course. The toxin is of my design. Oh shit. I was taken back. The virus was created by the owls themselves, and the pair seemed content with letting us die a slow death. Assholes. They didn't care about our fate one bit. At a loss for words, I remember picking a couple of dried berries from my backpack. At the very least, I would not die on an empty stomach. Oh. Oh, yummy, the, young, the younger owl lets out. Oh my god, are we gonna fucking bribe them? <laughs> this was all I needed. I started to eat the berries in front of him very slowly, his eyes enviously following their trajectory from the back to my mouth. We could make some sort of trade, I suggested as I picked up another berry. Absolutely not, the owl, old owl said. I bet you, the old owl is Strix? And the young one is probably his his apprentice, I bet ya. But, but, please, Kripse, Kripex? Oh, so it's not Strix, okay. I'm so hungry and you know how berries are my favorite fruit, the younger one pleaded. After several minutes of them arguing, the elder one got so annoyed that he reluctantly accepted. They gave us the antidote in exchange of a bunch of dried berries. As soon as I drank the antidote, I started to feel much better. The owls had decided to come back to our base camp. The old one wanted to see the full scale of our nuisance. Although they were quite rude and ready to leave us to die just a few hours ago, I was confident I could win their trust with time. After all, we still had a lot of dried berries in our supplies. Oh, the sneaky humans. Oh, man, they're so sneaky! That is great! Lovely. Oh, you piece of... There we go. Us! Ah, I couldn't get to it. Damn it. But at least we have one villager and a couple of uh, memory shots. So that's nice to know at least. So those little ones die by themselves. I cannot even hit them. But I just need to get the nest basically is what I, I get from this. It's nice to know. Not wasting uh, time... Uh, with the, the small ones. What is going on here? There's fire. There are crystals. What is going on? There's like a lot these, of crystal in fire. These are the soldiers we saw earlier. It looks like a huge battle just took place. This bodes ill for Oh, the yeah! Comrades. Oh, no! That's not good! Huh! I bet you I'm going to have to remember a lot of this stuff. Shit. I gotta, I, I gotta jump there, I, I assume. Hmm. So who are these soldiers? Like, you would think that... Um, that this is a kind of a... Oh, I did it right. You would think that I did it right. Kinda. I don't know. Oh, you're just gonna leave me hanging there. Yoink! <laughs> okay, so far. So good! Okay, this is better. There is only one place in this barren wasteland where the enemy could have taken the Celestial Guards. There are ruins not far from here. The Temple of Midland. However, nothing good has ever been known to come out of that place. That is very uh, unsettling. But we have no only choice, really. Only fools like us would dare trespass into the exactly. Temple of Midland. <laughs> this cursed temple was a remnant of the past. The rumors said that the Black Veil over Numbra 
was originally cast from this location a thousand years ago. Wow, the god okay. Miklan consumed everything to create the eternal night, legend said. Uh, we were bound to find out if they held any truth. That is this the case. The Temple of Midland. Wasn't he kind of the trickster? I don't remember actually, but wasn't I, I just I I I kinda of fool myself thinking he was um the um the trickster. I'd be wrong, I probably Supposedly, am. These statues were built to honor Mictland's most devoted followers. What an unsettling sight. Ah! Do you hear that? <laughs> oh, that's lovely. Okay, that was totally worth it. Totally worth it. Now, where? No. Let's see where this goes. This entire temple is a death trap. I know I'm asking for a lot, but try to keep your recklessness in check. No promises there. Four memory shards and four villagers? Jesus Christ on a bicycle. Oh! Hello? Anything here? No? It's just uh, traps? Gotcha. Oh! I am screwed. Anything down here? Oh, there is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Can I? Uh, I'm kind of curious now. I can! Oh, that's cool! So I can trigger them with my bugs. There we go, there we go, there we go. Secrets all over the place! It's lovely. Lovely. Okay, 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 okay. X? No, not that. X. Please, please. There we go. Okay. Yoink! Woo! There we go. And why all the way down? There we go. This is cool. This is fun. This is awesome. But uh, mm, let's not do that. There we go. Beautiful. Totally worth it. Okay, 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 okay. I was about to say, uh, I can see nothing. There we go. November 30th, 1590. With the pair of owls leading us across the swamp, we came back to the base much faster this time around. In hindsight, Rippet and his grandson Strix Pix. It has to be Strix. Were quite likable once you gained the trust. Griffix, the elder, told me they were part of an order, the night owls. It has to be. Supposedly, this order had watched for ir irregularities over the land for centuries. It seemed we fit the description and, as such, need to be evaluated immediately. The pair had been stationed in the marshlands for a while and was set to return to the Order's headquarters in a few days. Grivix also said that we had been lucky to run, run into them and not the Black Swarm. The name meant nothing to me, but according to the old bird it was something quite sinister. It couldn't be much worse than what we had encountered in the swamps thus far. When we finally reached the camp, I was fearing the worst, but to my surprise and relief, everyone was fine. After hours of research and countless attempts, Isan and her team had successfully analyzed the toxin and developed their own antidote. The crew, for the most part, was all healed up. I couldn't tell if the old Gripex was annoyed or impressed by Isan's feet. Maybe a bit of both. 
The toxin had uh, was of his design after all. The young Stripix, on the other hand, quickly befriended our cooking crew and whoever had the few berries to spare. <laughs> Lovely. I explained our purpose here and, while Griffix wasn't originally pleased with the idea of having more humans possibly ruining around, uh, running around Numbra, he said I would have the opportunity to plead my case to the Order's Council if I wished to. After this whole saga, we decided to take a few days to rest and reset our minds. We needed to be ready, our journey wasn't over yet. The Night Owl's Council was located in the heart of an exotic forest past the swamp. The pair would guide us there as they had decided to return early from the civilian's trip to the marshlands. I asked Gripix about the perpetual darkness of Numbra and he looked at me, incredulous. He said it had always been this way. It made me smile. It would be up to me to find the answer to this mystery. I bet you that Stri 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 Stripix, I think it was, Stripix is Strix where he's kind of changed his name. And that um, Griffix is his like father or grandfather or something like that. And then I'm kind of like, what is uh, what is Griffix up to now? Is he dead, or is he? Um, yeah, I don't know. It's very interesting though. I really like this. Hello, I'm just going to be on top of your head. I don't hope you mind. I'm sure you don't mind. After all, I'm a pleasant little fe fella. Possibly couldn't be any problem. Oh no. Hey. Ah! Curious to kill the cat. It did for me this time though. Okay. Okay. So I bet you. Easy. Oh! That was the wrong button. Damn it! Ah! <laughs> okay. Try one more time. Damn it, damn it! Ooh! So now what do I do? No. There we go, okay, so that's what we Okay. Shit! <laughs> oh, this is the worst! Jesus Christ on the bicycle! Okay, so we should be safe here, kinda. The path splits in two. I'll trust your gut on this one, boy. One of them is gonna be a fucking dead end or an immediate death, I'm, ass I'm assuming. But uh, I'm going to take the other path, first of all. Because I am curious what is up here. No. There was nothing there. It was worth a try though. I wanna... Oh, okay. Okay, let's try and take the other path first. It wants me to go through the mouth. Yeah. Okay, so it just respond to any kind of movement. So it doesn't necessarily have to be that I am in his mouth. Okay, that makes sense, it makes sense. Okay. Still no trace of the other divinities. What could possibly have happened to them? Ah, okay, I can actually shoot them. Yes, please. Ah! Okay, never mind. Oh, this is smart. Uh, that was not smart. Let me try one more time. Because I'm very unsure if I actually got the villager with me. I don't think so, actually. Damn. I just want to see. Maybe I should just uh, shoot him. Come on. There we go. 
Okay, I got the villager. Okay. 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 Okay, so it didn't really matter which road I took. I see. Okay, okay. Okay, that's that's nice to know. Now, this probably has something to um, to say. Let me just try one more time. I hope and pray that there's not a fucking villager over there on the other side because that is not going to be fun at all. Just throwing that out there. So that one. And then... There we go, okay. Now we have a checkpoint. I want to see what's on this road then. Yeah, that's a... That's that's a secret. I bet you that's a secret up there. Who knows what awaits us inside these cursed ruins? I don't know, Strix, oh, but we're not I'm going there yet. Too old for this insanity. Yeah, well, me too. <laughs> me too, but we have to do it, dude. Come on, live life, right? Yeah, there we go. I fucking knew it. I need to. I need. To, I, I need to remember to use the B button. There we go. Okay. Go. Use the B button. Use the B button. Please kick. There we go. Beautiful. There we go. Much better. Oi! <laughs> That's not fucking wall jump, dude. There we go. Much better. Okay, let's quickly see if... Um, stop it. If, the, if there's anything I need to be uh, aware of. Okay. Uh, if that is Act 2, I'm actually not doing... Yeah, I'm actually doing okay, it seems. I'm not doing, like, amazing. But I'm not doing half bad, actually, in my opinion. In any case, it's not... Um, it's not what I'm supposed to do anyway. I just need to go back. <laughs> okay. Oh, oops. Shit. Hmm. Okay, so I need to be a little better at using that. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. I see. It's gonna be a little tough for me. I am not in doubt about that. Because um, it forces me, or not forces me, but it asks me to use um, my speed and I am not a fan of that what do I need to be aware of to get out of here I Turn see that back is no longer an option at this point damn it it's a good thing I got that checkpoint I see that I want that there we go there we go I saw that I just saw it so I was like I need that okay. hello dude can you uh, give me a ride again please there we go read that so I'll just quickly go in it um, 
Let's get that up there. And then, um, let me see if I can find it. That was not the one. No. No, then it's this one. Okay. I was awoken in the middle of the night by a panic ripex. A loud buzzing sound disturbed the quiet night and the ground was shaking all around us. I immediately thought it was an earthquake, but it was something much worse. The black swarm is coming. We have to leave now, the owl urged. Oh shit. We didn't even have time to grab any supplies. We gathered everyone at once and fled immediately. Ashen initially wanted to stay there and fight, but Grivix uh, called him a fool and yelled to run before it was too late. He let out a grunt and followed us. We ran as fast as we could, led by the young Strippix up in the air. Grivix stood behind the group, protecting our rear from an eventual attack. The buzzing intensified greatly as the black swarm started to catch up on us. It had picked up our trail. It was harder and harder to run with the ground shaking so much. I thought we were done for, but suddenly Strippix landed next to me and activated a secret switch. The switch opened a trap door on the nearest giant tree. Go inside, hurry up, he shrieked. We all went inside the back of the tree and Grivix closed the secret door behind. It was a secret lair designed by the night owls. It was not the first time the pair had encountered the swarm, and the best way to deal with it was to hide and pray not to get found out. Nothing could stand in its weight, not even the night owls. I couldn't remember how long we stayed hidden inside of the tree, but the swarm passed right by us. The buzzing was deafening and I could see fear uh, on my crew member's faces. After a while we got out and went back to the camp. Everything was destroyed in a savagery that I didn't know was possible. Without any su food supplies left, we were stuck in a pinch. And with the black swarm lurking by, it only made things worse. This is really fucking amazing. This is really cool. Okay, let's uh, continue. I see, I see, I see, I see. Oh, stop it. And then this... Yeah, there we go. I like how... Like, see! Woo! Oh! Oh! Okay, stop it. This is not good. Okay, let me try something quick. There we go, beautiful, beautiful. This might not work, but I'm gonna try. Okay. Where do I go from here? I do not know. Probably not that way. Or well, maybe it is. But uh, let's try not. Where am I going? I think I'm going the right way. But I'm not 100% sure. Huh. Let's check the warlock. Let's get them out and leave this place at once. Oh, okay. <clears throat> uh oh, we're rising. Oh shit, this is real. Woo, it's a light. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. And we, we, we have awoken him. Oh, the old god Miklen. Oh no, I'm stuck! That's sick point. That was bad. Before we go there though, I have a checkpoint now. So I kinda wanna go back and see what I maybe have missed. Villager! That was a villager. Okay, let's get him. If anything. It's really fucking cool. It really um, encourages you to explore. I really like that. That is great. 
Okay, let's uh, just quickly get on here. There we go. Okay, run, run, run. Fine. And we don't get get all the villagers. It's fine. It's fine. Um, at least we have one more. Okay, let's try it. Oh, there they are. I was like, where, where are they? But they're there. Oh, exciting. Let's get up and uh, see if we can help them. Okay, one more time, one more time. I see what I have to do. So I basically have to, um, well, poke a hole, but like destroy the wall to the left so I can, um, oh, it sucks my, I see. It. I thought I got it. Mm. One more time. One more time. Last time. And for realties. <laughs> no. It. What? Why do I need to shoot them? Hmm. I'll have to think about this one, I guess. I'll have to think about this one, I, I assume. Huh. Huh. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up in the section down below. And I'll see you in the next video. And until then, take care of yourself and each other. Bye for now.